we're hoping another good season for Monoposto Racing Club. It's our best ever calendar for the club, thanks to MSVR. We've got a tremendous set of venues. We're expecting average entries in the region of 50, perhaps 25 grid cars on a grid. Um, so it should be a really exciting and busy year for us. We've maintained the stability of the regulations for about the last five years now. So people know where they stand with the cars and they know the car won't suddenly become uncompetitive. Also this year for the first time we've introduced a new class, a Mono Z-Tech class, which is basically for spec Mono Z-Tech cars. And that's a, that's a very uh, cost effective um, class indeed, so we're expecting that to be very popular as well. Of course if you, if you turn, up, turn up at a meeting and there's another 29, 30 cars on the grid alongside you, there's always somebody to race, there's always a good race to be had. Um, the, the driving standards are very good, especially considering we are an entry level championship, so you do get novices, so the chances are you're not going to have an accident. The cost really depends very much on which class we're talking about. At the less costly classes, like Mono 1600, you can buy a Formula Vauxhall Junior for as little as £4,000 and expect to run it for maybe four or £5,000 over the season, provided you don't have too much accident damage. At the top end of the cost spectrum, a Dallara, you can certainly buy a competitive Monoposto spec Dallara for £15,000 and maybe spend £10,000 running it over the year. So it's more expensive, but of course, motor racing is expensive in, in, and in relative terms, that's a, that's a fairly uh, cost-effective season.